Welcome. My name is Nassim Yagaev. I'm the Consul General of Azerbaijan in Los Angeles. Um, welcome to this event. Distinguished elected officials, uh, distinguished Consul General and other members of the Consular Corps, dear friends, ladies and gentlemen. First of all, I would like to thank you all for joining us in this very important event. Drug abuse and drug trafficking today are one of the most painful problems of our societies. They're not limited to one country or nation. This problem has unfortunately become a transnational, global one. The purpose of this event is to increase the public awareness about the negative influences that drug abuse and trafficking are having on our societies, on the humanity in general. But the, the purpose is also to stress the importance of international cooperation in tackling this calamity. For Azerbaijan, fighting the drug abuse and trafficking is one of the top priorities. Under the leadership of President Ilham Aliyev, Azerbaijan has made big strides in, the fight, in this fight during the last decade. And the State Customs Committee, the main uh, co-organizer of this event, plays a vital role in preventing the illegal substances getting into Azerbaijan. The committee has also put a tremendous effort into the international cooperation in this regard, specifically collaborating with customs authorities of various countries in order to better coordinate the fight against this transnational problem. One of the most effective ways of this fight is also education. Educating the younger generation about this evil plays a crucial role in tackling drug abuse. One of the ways of this education is to showcase the negative impact of drug abuse through the power of art. The exhibition that the State Customs Committee organized and is presenting today to you serves namely this purpose. I thank the State Customs Committee for all the great work they are doing in this area. My special thanks also go to our partner in this event, namely the organization DARE, Drug Abuse Resistance and Education, which is one of the leading drug prevention organizations in, in the United States. I thank the president of DARE, Mr. Frank Begueros, for this great partnership, but also for the incredible job DARE is doing in terms of educating school children in America and in over 50 countries of the world against the drug abuse. In recognition of all Azerbaijani and American efforts to fight drugs, we are also presenting to you today a music concert performed by outstanding musicians from Azerbaijan. We will also have a ballet performance by dancers of the San Diego Ballet, which actually performed the whole Azerbaijani ballet called Seven Beauties in San Diego last October to great acclaim to a crowd of 3,000 people with big success. But before embarking on our cultural program, I would like to invite Mr. Gambay Aliyev, the representative of the State Customs Committee of Azerbaijan, to share his thoughts with you. Dear Consul General, Arrive, dear Mr. Frank Pugueras, distinguished guests, dear friends. Thank you very much for coming to this evening and participating in this important event. I would like to express our profound gratitude to Consulate General of Azerbaijan, Los Angeles, for all the cooperation and hard work in making tonight event possible. We are also pleased to partner in this event with DERE, one of the most active and productive drug prevention organizations in America. Thank you, Mr. Frank Pugueras, President of DEIE, for the great partnership. This event is part of our country's effort to further strengthen the strong relationship between our two countries. Being able to raise awareness around important global problems like drugs prevention and abuse can only work enhance the international cooperation on important issues between our two countries. 
The national leader of Azerbaijan and late President Haydar Aliyev had made one of the main goals of the country to expand mutually fruitful international relations with all the countries in the world and use this improving relation to find ways to allow Azerbaijan to support international efforts in order to help citizens as well as to develop our country's economic science and culture. The State's Customs Committee of Azerbaijan and the Azerbaijan Customs History Music spare no effort in safeguarding the rich history and cultural heritage of Azerbaijan and introducing it to the world community. Drug addiction is one of the most painful problems worrying nations around the globe. Drug addiction has become a painful part of everyday society and the serious danger for the future of nations. Drugs and their trafficking damage not only the health and morality of people, but also the economies of all the world. Millions of people in the world suffer from drug addiction, which impact mostly the young people. The rising trend is dangerous for our communities and people. In the recent years, the fight against drugs in Azerbaijan has become one of the most important goals for the government. The State's Customs Committee takes one active part in fighting against illicit drug trafficking, which poses a global threat, ruining human health and undermining the stability and progress of our society. The exhibition No to Drugs has been featured around the world with exhibits in the capital of the Republic of Macedonia, Skopje, on November 25, 26, 2013, and in September 2012 in Porto, Portugal. Most recently, on October 3, 2014, the Azerbaijan Customs History Music Museum held an exhibition named Not to Drugs in Malta. Dear guests, the exhibition that you will be seeing today was based on the most successful displays of the above mentioned cartoon and art exhibitions and contests as is dedicated to fight against drug addiction. We believe that this exhibition will stimulate personal reflection of the importance of the fight against drug addiction. Thank you again for coming to this evening and enjoy the music and art. And say no to drugs. Thank you, Mr. Aliyev. And now I would like to give the floor to the president of Adair, Mr. Frank Pegueros. Good evening. Um, I have the, the privilege of bringing, being the president of Dare International, and as such, uh, represent more than 30,000 law enforcement officers delivering the Dare program in not only the United States but 50 other countries. And on behalf of all in the Dare family, thank you for allowing us to uh, be a partner in this event. On behalf of all the members of the Dare family, I wish to acknowledge the government. Uh, uh, and the leadership of the Republic of Azerbaijan for their efforts in addressing the problems of illegal drug trafficking and drug abuse. Not only for what they're doing in their own country, but the leadership role that they have assumed regionally and transnationally. It's a significant problem around the world, and unless it's addressed uh, in a positive and affirmative fashion, we can't do anything about it. I would like to um, ask the uh, Major General uh, to, uh, to join us. Sir, on, on behalf of your efforts to make the world a safer place for all citizens, but particularly the children of the, uh, of the world, thank you so very, very much. Thanks so much. For your efforts. Thank you. Thank you. We train law enforcement officers to, uh, to go into the classroom, to uh, work with students to develop uh, a good decision-making model so that they can make 
wise decisions about high-risk behaviors in their life um, regarding drug abuse and, and other uh, issues that they face on a daily basis. Uh, we've had success in this country of reducing youth substance abuse since its highs in the early uh, 1980s. Um, we've re achieved about a 50% reduction in illicit substance abuse except for marijuana. Um, but as with most prevention efforts, once you have success, uh, attention seems to be drawn away, believing that that success is going to continue. It's events such as this uh, that refocus attention on the problem, and, and it's, uh, it's vitally important that we do focus on it. And I would like to thank the Council General for his efforts to bring this exhibit um, to, to help the, the citizens of California, both Northern and Southern California. We had a similar event last week in San Francisco. Thank you so much for bringing this to uh, the public to remind people that this still remains a problem that we need to deal with. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you very much. You, you will enjoy the uh, exhibit tonight um, because as with uh, the process that we teach children, there's no one way to teach a child. You will see many, many ways uh, to visualize the negative consequences and the impact of uh, illicit substance abuse. Enjoy the exhibit. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much, Mr. Figueros. Um, by the way, uh, for your information, we, six days ago, we had the same event in San Francisco to a crowd as nice as yours. And so uh, to th this event is not just in Los Angeles. We tr uh, decided to do it in both most, uh, uh, two of the most important cities in California. And now I would like to invite um, uh, Ms. Lourdes Saab, who is the Deputy Chief of Protocol for the Los Angeles County Board of Supervisors. Thank you, Consul General Lagayev, distinguished members of the Consular Corps, friends of Azerbaijan, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, on behalf of the County Board of Supervisors, it's a pleasure and a privilege to always commend this Consul General and his amazing staff for putting on these wonderful cultural programs and now tonight a program of deep meaning. Our government and the, and the government of Azerbaijan are working together to be able to extend these services of customs and border protection that is uh, such an important need for the world that is getting so much smaller. But it is uh, uh, my pleasure, because I know we're very, I'm between now and the fabulous concert and music, and uh, I'd like to present this to Gambay Aliyev, who is here going to be accepting this for Mr. Aydin Aliyev, Chairman of the State of Customs Committee of the Republic of Azerbaijan. On behalf of the residents of the County of LA at Board of Supervisors, we really bid you a warm welcome and thank you again for your support along with the consulate and his supporters of this wonderful evening of saying no to drugs and amazing cultural uh, beauties of Azerbaijan. So with, uh, without more ado, uh, it's signed by the five members of Board of Supervisors, Mike D'Antonovich, Hilda Solis, Mark Ruley thomas Sheila Kuehl, and Don Kanabi. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Saab. And I have here a, a big proclamation from Mayor Eric Garcetti, the mayor of the city of Los Angeles. Uh, here's the proclamation. And with this proclamation, um, the mayor, uh, Eric Garcetti, proclaims February 6th, uh, the 12th, 2015, as the International Say No to Drugs Day in the city of Los Angeles and commends the efforts by the Council General of Azerbaijan and Azerbaijan's Customs Committee in fighting drug abuse and trafficking. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Thank you. And uh, with this, uh, the, the uh, official speeches uh, end, and uh, we will start our program, cultural program. <laughs>
Sinan üstü ak pamuklu gel tanalardı. Bulvar göy hazerde katar katardı. Yurdum yuvam meskenim sen Azerbaycanım. Anam doğma vatanım sen Azerbaycanım. Yurdum yuvam meskenim sen Azerbaycanım. Anam doğma vatanım sen Azerbaycanım.
Vüqar Cavazadə. Ayaz Qasımov. Afaq Abbasıva. Samir Cəfərov. What a great performance. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Well, um, I absolutely love the music, um, and I love the differentiate the different singers because they each had a unique kind of tone. Um, I wish I could uh, speak uh, Azerbaijani so I could understand what they were singing about, but obviously um, the audience absolutely loved it and applauding and. Um, singing along. I've heard people singing along. It was a wonderful evening of music and dance. I thought the singing, the dancing, it was superb. And then I love the posters and I love the artwork. I didn't realize, I mean, there's, there's a trouble with drug trafficking, but I didn't realize that drug trafficking was this in this extent. So um, something needs to be done. So this is a very good program that you put on here, the consulate, and no one drugs, great. My name is Howard Winkler. I'm the, a member of the Narcotics and Dangerous Drugs Commission for Los Angeles County, and I'd like to say your show is tremendous. What you're doing here is a great service to our country and to your country, and I really appreciate everything you're doing. Thank you very much.